In this video, we are going to show you how to use the Ether Badge. The Ether Badge is an affordable universal tool for learning in vehicle networking. Ether Badge supports four interfaces CAN, CANFD, Automotive Ethernet, and LIN. In addition, the badge also supports analog inputs and digital outputs on a single device. All of these networks and I.O. can be controlled by Intrepid's powerful Vehicle Spy software, as well as Intrepid's open source APIs. The Ether badge features one channel of CAN-FD, one channel of LIN, one channel of 100 base T1 automotive Ethernet using mini USB connectors, six channels of zero to five volts analog input, four channels of five volts digital output, one potentiometer, one temperature sensor, and seven onboard LEDs. You can combine several Ether badges with Intrepid's three-port automotive switch badge. The switch badge is a development and demonstration platform utilizing Marvell's 88Q5030 Ethernet switch. It can be connected to up to three 100 base T1 devices, including Intrepid's Ether badge, or can be daisy chained with other switch badges to experiment with larger networks. You can use a push-in mating connector or use through holes for soldering I.O. to connections. The Ether badge does not have built-in selectable termination resistors. Therefore, an external resistor is required on the CAN high and CAN low. You can use the built-in through holes for the resistors or use the breadboard to add the termination. You can use the Ether badge with Vehicle Spy 3, Vehicle Spy X using Python or C++ using our open source APIs, or socket can using the Intrepid kernel module. You can also buy a case for your Ether badge from Intrepid, or if you have access to a 3D printer, then we recommend you print your very own Ether badge case using our free 3D STL file and 3D model located on our website. Using push-in mating connectors, you can easily connect to different networks with Ether badge. Vehicle Spy X is our new cross-platform vehicle network software for creating automation writing scripts using Python, and creating AutoSAR application. vSpy X makes it easier for you to work on Windows, Linux, Mac OS, or embedded Linux platforms. When you first open vSpy X, you will be greeted with a welcome message in Topology View. Topology View helps you view your frame source, connect controllers to channels, and more. Just plug in your Ether badge and choose to activate the device and go online to see traffic without decodings. You can also add a database file to your Vehicle Spy X folder or go to the terminal view in Vehicle Spy X to write your Python script. You can also run this in Visual Studio Code by installing the Python wheel and using import vSpy X at the top of a Python 3 file. To read our full documentation, go to the Help drop down menu and select Documentation. or watch our tutorial videos on our YouTube channel. If you are using Ether Badge with Vehicle Spy 3 software, we make it easier for you to create different messages using Messages Editor, create scripts using Function Blocks, create different gateways using Gateway Builder, and more. Once you have the Vehicle Spy software installed, connect your Ether Badge to your computer using the USB Type-C cable. Then select Setup Hardware and press the Connect button in the NeoVi Explorer window. This will connect to the Ether badge and read the settings currently stored in the device. Using NeoVi Explorer window, you can configure different settings for your Ethernet, CAN, and LIN networks. You can use the Core Mini Console for loading Core Mini scripts into Ether badge so you can run the script without using Vehicle Spy. To load Core Mini, click Tools, check the Run After Download, and Send. We work hard to provide you with the best hardware and software experience. Not only do our Ether badges go through a burn-in test to find any potential problems, but we also do regression testing on our Vehicle Spy software. To learn more about our Ether badge, please visit our website at intrepidcs.com/etherbadge.